is now an island. We need smiles, a touch now and then. We need affection to survive. Yeah. Yeah, that's what all the social beings, flock animals. We need relations to be happy. We live by reflecting ourselves in each other, taking that energy that one another give. Not that our souls would dry up, our energy would fade out, we would be depressed, become nothing. Everybody needs somebody to love. Do you know that song? Mm -hmm. I'm glad I got you. You should love your fellow beings, nature, animals, strangers. <laughs> no, why should you? Do you mean we should look the other way? Why give yourself more trouble than you already have? I mean, it's easier that way. It eases your mind. Why care about a stranger? He don't care about you. I can't believe what I'm hearing. How can you be so insensitive? <laughs> That's the easy part. Mind your own business. Care for yourself. That's what the whole world is about. Egoist. Selfishness and self-centered egoism is the root to all evil. I can't take that. What I'm saying is, you care for yourself first. Mind your own ego. It's a rule for surviving. Some got bigger egos than others. I'm, s I'm sorry, alright?
consciousness expand from needs. If you have needs, you get more observant of yourself. The pain of your needs makes you understand what is necessary. It all comes down to the basics. Food, warmth, love and affection. You have to see it in a different perspective, in a bigger picture.